To bra or not to bra? That is the question. Is it better in the slings to suffer when no one but my family sees? To let my back and body have a rest and my boobs to swing at ease? To bra or not to bra? Is it really that big of a deal? Am I morally bound to bind them? Does it matter how I feel? Will my husband oppose me in this freedom? Will my sons be embarrassed and protest? Will the jiggling cause waves of troubles? Is it worth it for my body's rest? My shoulders ache, my back complains, and yet my mind argues with insistence. Is how I look really that important when there's so much social distance? When I sleep, yes, in dreaming, there is the rub. I am free then, of course, and always there's the tub. But this doesn't seem enough. Too many hours in the day. Could this virus have an upside? Could it actually bring away? Do we at last have excuse, the perfect opportunity? There's the respect to no longer keep them harnessed, no longer keep our boobs in check. This is the calamity of life for women in the States who bear the strong elastic bands that hold these mighty weights. No longer fearing stares, whispers, and outright spurs. Are we at last given freedom? Is this a lesson that we've learned? Can our bare bodies shake without a leash to bear? No longer sweating under heavy wire. Why do we even care? Is this an undiscovered paradise? If so, why the puzzling of will? Is this a matter of my conscience? But then, what's really ill? Let them fly! In moderation, covered with a shirt, of course. Swing with liberty in isolation. A revolution of sorts. To bra or not to bra? Should we lose it and be set free? It's just a question that I've considered. But then maybe it's just me.